I used to look at this image with so much hope and love for the future, but now it makes me feel depressed. The fact that we're even talking about the prospect of becoming the successors to the original Big Three, Iron Man, Cap, and Thor, at this moment only makes it sad. Yeah, so what this Redditor is trying to say is that this image right here shares a massive story about how bright the future is full of possibilities for the MCU, but now kind of serves as a reminder of what could have been. For example, Spider-Man has kind of been written into a corner because No Way Home made everyone forget about who Spider-Man was, and now in the fourth movie, what's gonna happen? He's gonna pull off some wizardry to make people remember who he is again, so that way he can seemingly fight with the Avengers. And on top of that, if Sony continues to act like corporate goons, we'll probably never get to see Spider-Man in a lead role due to his rights belonging to Sony. But I think the saddest part was the potential of Captain Marvel and Black Panther. Like, with regards to Captain Marvel, hot take, I would not have minded her leading an Avengers team. She deserves that spot. But Marvel really cucked up that sequel so damn bad that I wouldn't be surprised if Brie Larson wants nothing to do with the MCU anymore. And then Chadwick Boseman, that one hurts the most because celebrity deaths are a big deal to me every now and then, but Chadwick gave me a whiplash. This man had cancer for four years and he filmed so many movies, including that Godzilla that was Black Panther 1. Like he was doing all that while he was straight up dying from cancer. This man right here is probably the most mentally strong celebrity of this generation of cinema because he wanted nothing more but to deliver on his movies. He was a rising star and despite how big of a deal having cancer is, he just didn't want to say anything. He wanted no attention. He wanted his movies to get attention. So yeah, it does suck that this picture is now a big what if, but in the end, I, I think Marvel is currently going through sleepless nights to make sure that the next few movies have a purpose and that everything is so good that the only what if we could think of is what if this movie was bad.